The NFL divisional playoffs are this weekend and more states than ever before are allowing some form of sports betting. Just take a look at all of this red. And now that you can place a bet from your phone, research from the American Gaming Association expects the number of people betting to go up nearly 75% when all is said and done by the end of the season. And News Nation correspondent Tom Negevin is live for us at FanDuel Sportsbook at the Meadowlands, which is just outside of New York. So Tom, some of these companies literally giving away money to draw those gamblers in, but there has to be a catch. So cynical, Nicole, but yeah, that's what you'd think, right? There has to be. What if there wasn't a catch, though? What if free money really meant free money because these sportsbook companies are so eager to one-up each other, and that's just the bet they're willing to make on this industry? For a mobile sports better, there's never been a better time. It's like anything else, you got to control it. As more sports books go live in more markets, the stakes go up in the battle for your business. DraftKings, FanDuel, Rush Street Interactive, Caesars, entering the mobile betting market in two dozen states, all offering more or less the same thing. So the best way to get your money might be to give you some of theirs. And we have seen a lot of competition between operators and what they're fundamentally doing is renting the customer's attention. Experts say it costs between two and eight hundred dollars to acquire a customer, but their value could be many times that. So you get paid to sign up with a chance, if you play the odds right, to beat the house with its own cash. Are people responding? Well, let's Look at the numbers. Data compiled by Canadian tech company GeoComply Solutions shows more than 1.2 million new accounts created in New York since mobile betting began 13 days ago. But here's the real kicker. Nearly 88% of those customers are new to legal sports betting. I make good money off of it. I'm here right now actually to pick up a couple bucks. And this is only expected to grow. Why are so many lawmakers signing their states up? Well, the answer, again, is... The bottom line is New York State cares about the money. It's going to be an extremely lucrative revenue stream for them. Big business here in New Jersey, across the river in New York State. Nicole, uh, this is expected to be a $1.5 billion business by the year 2025. So big money at stake here, free money up for grabs, and that's just the price these companies are willing to pay. But remember, it's not show friends, it's show business. This is a business, not a charity. And they have that saying, Nicole, you'll remember it, something about the house and Always winning. Oh, yeah, absolutely right. Great reporting there, Tom, and not the first time I've been accused of being cynical either. Thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.